Are we live? Um, Are we rolling? We're live right now. We're live right now. We're rolling right now? Yeah. I've never been on YouTube or the news before, so <laughs> this is my, my first time doing this, something like this. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> Yeah, what's going on? I'm on the planet of the vapes. That nickname was made up by my dad, who's never smoked weed before, but has tried an edible. He said it messed with his tinnitus though, so he didn't really enjoy it. I homemade them things for him, so I know they were good too, because I sampled a bunch of them first. They were really nice, but yeah. Thanks, Dad, and thanks for supporting the channel. Not financially, but... I mean, for the first 18 years of my life, you did. <laughs> and, and that was actually a perfect nickname for today because today we're doing a vape thing. This is the Puff Shot by the people over at... Um, I forget where they're from, actually. But you can find it at puffshotlife.com. Uh, but I think they're the same... I think it's Hay Bar. I think the people at Hay Bar make this. So they also make the Hay Pipe, and they also send us that at the same time. It's, Find it at puff, puffshotlife.com. Anyway, it's the puff shot. It's a vape thing. It comes uh, in here. They only sent me one, so I can't do a giveaway. Sorry. But we're going to take, we're going to open it, and we're going to find out about it. Now, it comes in, I think, three different versions or some shit like that. It comes with, as, a, as a cartridge thing. It comes as a wax thing. And it comes as a dryer vape, I think. But you have to buy, they, they come separately. They're not just interchangeable. Unfortunately, they asked me which one I wanted. I went with the Super 510 battery kit because I think it's like one of those kind of like drinkable vape things, and I like those and I feel like they work really well with carts. So we went with the cart. So anyway, you open it up like this, and then there's like that in there. Completely missed the trash can. Here's like our little instruction manual. They gave us a drinking straw from McDonald's and our actual device. Yeah, cool logoing on the back. Nice big screen and it's lighter weight than you think it's going to be. Feel this. Oh, wow. <laughs> Wait, what? Right? Is there a battery in there? There is apparently a battery in there. It also comes with this little box of goodies. That's everything you get in the box. Inside this little box of goodies is a mouthpiece if you want to attach a mouthpiece to it. And a charging cable. Oh, real shit though. What is this? Is... Oh, kit includes one puff shot device, one silicone mouthpiece, one straw, and one charging cable. You can use it with the straw if you want to. You can use it with the mouthpiece, or you can use it with nothing. But I'm gonna use it with this Benoit THCA Exotic Kush Live Rosin. Benoit. Send us over a bunch of cartridges. This is the last one that, that I have. It's been sitting, it's been waiting, and I can't wait to try it out. So we're going to, give me, give I'm me. Sorry. <laughs> I'm it. We're gonna throw this in here. I'm gonna look at the instructions. Got it. And so this piece comes off like that. <laughs> this piece comes off like that. Your cart, you just rip the bottom off and the top off. And it just screws down in here like this. See, it seems like, I wanna believe that like the other two just have like a different connection piece in here. You know what I mean? But if that's the case, then why can't you just include those in the kit and everyone can have all of them? You know what I mean? It's childproof mode. Oh, you can lock and unlock it. Anyway, this, this slides back on over top like that. That slides like that, it has a little locking thing. And you're good to go. Should we use the little mouthpiece that it comes with? Or the straw? That's what the mouthpiece looks like. Yeah, I guess that'd be kind of weird. You could just do that. I'm just gonna do it like this. All right, anyway, let's take a hit. Cheers. Ooh, the screen's actually really nice. 2.9 volts. You can turn the time up and down. 
I'm gonna do a 20 second. It's preheating. It's this. As she fills up. Look at that. That's cool. This time I'm gonna use this mouthpiece. Look, it has like little vents in the side. Jesus Christ. Hit my lungs so hard. The straw, man. <laughs> the straw hits. <laughs> the other two I was feeling okay. I just called for like 10 minutes. All right, anyway, uh, the puff shot, it's got variable voltage. You can click this middle button twice and then you can use the plus and minuses to change the voltage. If you hold these down, it goes into child proof mode. So unless your child can figure out how to also just hold these two down to unlock it, you're good to go. <laughs> you won't be able to figure it out. Let's keep the instruction manual in a trash can or something. But then you might need you might need to refer back to it. Anyway, it's pretty easy to use, honestly. So two clicks, <coughs> you can change the, uh, what's it called, the power. Uh, double click this one and it changes something else and then you double click this one and that changes something else as well. I'll tell you what they are. The plus button twice does the auto working time. So uh, I think that's like how it fills up. I didn't have to change mine. It worked perfectly the first time I did it. I don't know what it's set to, but I think it knows what it's doing. Uh, the second one preheats. This one, if you click this one, the minus button twice, that preheats. So like, you know, if, you, if your pen's clogged or whatever, you just hit that twice. And then uh, one click and this starts and makes that noise and then it's good to go. It comes with this little mouthpiece. I tried all three. The mouthpiece is surprisingly smooth, honestly. It also has these little holes in the side that I guess like vent it. I don't, I don't really know why they need that, but they're also there. Five clicks on and off. It's got USB-C charging in the back. Pretty, pretty straightforward, honestly. Cool, cool little device. I've seen a lot of these. I'm not sure how much this one costs or if I have a discount code for it. If I do, I'll leave it right here. I do get a comment almost every time I do one of these videos about how come you didn't put water in it? N fucking none of these bitches take water. I have three of these motherfuckers. None of them have a water function. Unless you want to just completely, <laughs> completely ruin your device. I don't recommend putting water in it <laughs> because as you can see, it's just, it's just, this is all it is. These are the pieces. Where are you going to put water in this? I don't understand. That just goes over that and then this clicks onto this. My man that wants to know about the water function, hit me with your video using the water function. I'd love to see it. Here's my question about this though, for real. That's all sticky now. How come they can't, like obviously, I, I feel like they all just screw into a 510 battery. You know what I mean? Oh, this actually even comes out. Are you kidding me? So this is the 510 battery one. You know what I mean? Like why can't they just include the other ones that you can use? Cause I know they have a dab version of it too. I don't understand why they can't just be like, here's the device that comes with all the things. Instead of being like, now you have to go buy something else if you want to use it a different way. You know what I mean? Like if it comes in different modes, 
Just give me all the, like, just throw the extra coil in this fucking box. <laughs> you have a whole box. You only put this in there. And what was the other thing that came in here? And this mouthpiece came in there. Like, you could fit another fucking coil thing in there. Like, look how much fucking room is in that. Like, you can yeah. fit, you can fit the other accessory to make it a dab thing. Fucking company's cheaping out on shit. That's what I, that's that shit I don't like. Boom, that's in there. So now, even if the other one's bigger, you can put this one in here, have the other one pre-installed. You know what I mean? Same fucking size and wow, you won't make an extra like whatever, how much money off of it. Too fucking bad. <laughs> it says for cartridge and dab. It keeps saying and dab, but mine didn't come with the dab part. And on here, on like the little, what comes in the box thing, nothing about that says a dab thing either. Right? Let's click on one of these. It says it's compatible with wax, carts, and pod systems. Maybe it does come with all three. I don't fucking know. I can't find out on their website. I searched around on their website for a while. It seems like it's supposed to come with all three, but mine only came with one. It's supposed to work with cartridges, wax, and pods. But I think I got one that was specifically 510 battery only. And I think maybe because I'm an influencer, so they were just like, what kind are you gonna use it for in the video? Like shit, I would've tried it with all three to be honest, but whatever. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go upstairs and continue to cough for a long time and drink a bunch of water because that shit just hit me in the chest like fucking. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, like that. <laughs> My nose is all fucking runny and shit. God damn. See, like, I take a bunch of hits for that, that little slow-mo section. It doesn't look like much, but it it is a lot. And, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Where was I? Sometimes, sometimes I get so high during during the fucking the one minute part of the video in between me talking and me talking now that I get very lost on what to do in this section. So if there's a link, it'll be in the comments. If you're a Patreon, I'll see you for the bonus smoke session after. We might have to record that one later and just slide it into the back. Or we'll just have Danny hit this a bunch of times and I'll, I'll sit here and talk and she'll talk about it. But I'll see you on the bonus smoke shush either way. And that's that's how that's how we end it. <laughs> the pop shot. Like a little uh like that thing about the fuck the fact that they're gonna like try to reschedule weed. I think we should do a little video with that, but we just like what the fuck? So this part comes apart. That's something I didn't know before. <laughs> What's wrong, Annie? You came out of the bedroom smiling and then your smile faded as you leaned against the door.